Hey everybody. So today I'm coming to you about a very important um, case called the largest unit, um, the largest case in United States history regarding child sex trafficking. And I am the descendant of Mahalia Jackson, and she was called the large. She was called the greatest gospel singer of the world uh, many many years ago. And the Ku Klux Klan found me because I'm her great niece, and they were like, okay, so they like. And my dad sold me to them because he wanted money and had them sex enslave me when I was four years old. And I was raped, gang raped, um, at about at four years old and I died many times. And then later on, I began to write songs in 1987. And one of my first songs was God Will Make Away. And, they, and then they sold me again to Don Moen and Integrity Music. So they're a part of the church. Um, we're suing them for lying on my songs and um, buying copyrights and the Copyright Office in Atlanta, Georgia was involved in it, as well as Mariah Carey. She lied on several songs, including Hero, Can't Take That Away, several songs. Will Jennings lied on um, My Heart Will Go On. Diane Warren lied on most of the songs she, she claimed she wrote, Because You Love Me, um, I have several songs. Um, uh, because You Love Me, Run To You, Run To The Arms. Uh, even Chris Tomlin lied on How Great Is Our God. Uh, Hillsong United lied on several songs, including What It Be Fame It Is with Joel Houston and Ben Fielding and um, Brooke Lagerwood and family. Long Jim Music lied on several songs um, that Sponge Kaylin uh, Carter sing. And Ed Sheeran lied on Thinking Out Loud, perfect, and all these different songs I wrote. And today I'm trying to get the victory over them because they had my voice recorded and had to listen to it. And Ghosty Records uh, lied on many songs with uh, Kevin McKeon, also known as Toby Matt and Kurt Franklin. So it's a very, very, very big case with a lot of people involved in it lying on songs. And casting crowns, people, mercy me, Bart Milliard, it's, a, it's huge. And these people you think are very nice people, just human traffickers. Those guys on 10th Avenue North, they lied on a few songs too, including By Your Side. Uh, Brandon Heath lied on Give Me Your Eyes and several other songs. And um, Brian White lied on God Gave Me You. And it's just, it's explosive, guys. And it's revealing the white supremacist people who believe, you know, they want people to sing my songs. As well as black people who just want to get rich. Beyonce Knowles and Michelle Williams and her Keisha uh, Wither. And they lied on several songs including Survivor, When Jesus Says Yes, or They Say Say Yes, and several other songs, Say My Name, Bills, 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 with uh, Candy Burrus. She's a human trafficker. She's married to a human trafficker. And they're all trying to conceal it. They've been paying the Atlanta Police Department, Sheriff's Department. And they were the ones trafficking me. And they made my life a living hell, you guys. And they would say, every time she sings, put a dick in her mouth. I mean, it was that serious. And they made my life a living hell. Fuck this and up that. They were cussing up a storm. And they were like, we're going to get away with it. They were selling my babies and going from house to house in Atlanta, Georgia, selling my children. Um, yeah, Tyler Perry was with them. And he didn't write Diary of a Mad Black Woman. Or well, most of the Medea stories I did were several child sex slaves. So it's about getting justice for the murder of all those beautiful people. Even astronauts included were murdered to keep it a secret. So I pray in the name of Jesus for this victory. Even though I think God is showing me he might just restart to earth or take me back to heaven. That's what really should happen. So I pray that does happen and so we don't worry about this situation. But it's these murderers and serial killers singing my songs and lying on them. And I pray to get justice in Jesus' name. Amen. I love you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe to learn more about the largest case in United States history. Thanks so much. In Jesus' name, God bless you. Bye-bye.